There's nothing like chilling with my girls Just me and my divas taking over the world What's up, D-Buzz? What's up, D-Buzz? What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, A. We about to slay, okay? We about to do it like it's our B-Day with this wig, okay? What's up, y'all? Hope y'all all having like a really great day. Go this video number three for me today, and it is only 1.30, okay? 1.30. In the afternoon, I said, you know what, April? We're gonna do videos throughout the week, so that way Saturday and Sunday, you ain't gotta do nothing but sit in your little house dress, put your feet up, and relax, okay? So this is the first for me with this company. I've never heard of this company before, but girl, they got you covered. Check their website. Out. They have all type of things that you can use for like theater, for movies, for projects. Like, you know what I'm saying? You're not you're not about to get no markers and paint. But everything that has to do with like makeup, hair, stuff like that, they got you wigs. <laughs> they got you, okay? So bear with me because I was never really good with saying this word in a whole theatrical, theatrical avenue, okay? I had to like really concentrate to say this. Theatrical Avenue is the name of this website. They sent me this 24 inch body wave, a lace front. Like I said, they do specialize in different products more than just lace fronts, but they have everything else that you can imagine or need for your beauty needs okay so I did bleach the unit it was bleached it was not bleached when it came to me and I did pre-pluck some of the hairs but not too many because it was already thinned out now this one does not come with any type of elastic band so if you're wanting one girl you best to sew it on yourself okay but it does come with the standards adjustable strap at the nape the combs and such like that and I went ahead look girl I put this wig in a braid two braids because I did want to tweeze some of the hairline last night then I realized girl do a middle part like you always got it on the side and plus because it's a 13 by four you can see more of the actual parting in the middle versus as a 13 by four in the sides you just very you get very little parting so i wanted to show you guys all of the parting so i went ahead and decided to put it in the middle part then i just spritzed it with some water and just said i'm just going to put some body waves in it because it is the body wave. we're gonna see how it looks during the next day now let me tell y'all they must know that their wig is gonna be awesome they must got real good faith in their wig because this didn't come with nothing but the plastic bag and a piece of paper okay in a yellow manila envelope all right that's how it came a, a bubble wrapped envelope yellow manila one it was no extras was no edge brush was no clips wasn't wasn't no no lip gloss no lashes no no edge control wasn't none of that but the wig so i feel like if you know your wig is is perfect and you ain't got to send nothing extra all we care about is the wig in reality okay sometimes people be like oh why you send me all that stuff you trying to make up for the good and the bad okay so theriatrical the avenue they sent the wig there was no other stuff you can check out their website we're gonna jump into it i mean i'm gonna show you how your wig come of course all you're gonna do is see it on the mannequin hand but we're gonna just jump right into this video okay yeah girl <laughs> I wish I had the same delusion That I do when I was two and Didn't think that I could ruin Anything at all, I could never fall I wish I had that same conviction Convinced I never needed fixing Yeah, that girl really knew her business Where did she go? Yeah, she thought she could do anything Thought she could get anywhere Confident she's number one and if not, then everybody's wrong Used to be calm, now I can't remember How I used to do it, that I was a member Of Confidence Club, cause that don't last forever I wish I saw what she saw I wish I knew what she knew I love how she just stoned the bus you guys so let's get in a little tweezing i decided just to tweeze a little bit on camera i redid the opposite side which was the left or the right or the left so i'm just going to go ahead and do the right side with you guys and then you just want to make sure you comb thoroughly because there's loose hairs in there girl now here's the part where you have to customize the unit i went ahead and parted right above my earlobe right there and then i'm going to take my small sharp scissors and just cut directly into that part just to make sure that your wig fits flat and flush to your circumference and then you just want to repeat that on the opposite side now i'm going to go ahead and take my scissors and cut the lace in three particular portions now i'm going to use my pink and sheer scissors to give it some jagged edges so that way the lace is not blunt and straight and you just want to repeat that on 
the middle and the opposite side. Now I'm gonna go ahead and flip up the unit and I'm gonna use my favorite hairspray, which you guys already know, and which is the Aussie Insta Freeze. I'm gonna go ahead and put the first layer on and allow it to get tacky. And then I'm gonna go ahead and spray the second layer on and allow that also to get tacky prior to me spraying on my third layer, which I will be applying the unit onto it wet. Now, as you see here, this is the third layer and I'm gonna spray the right side of my head first. And I'm going to go ahead and pull the lace down, spraying it on wet, like the third or fourth layer, and then pulling the lace down will give it a definite melt like see-through girl, invisible. Okay, that's how you get it invisible. So you wanna do each side, you know, at a time. So now I'll go ahead to the left side and spray that down and pull the lace on it while it's wet. Use my rat tail comb to press it into the hairspray and then use my blow dryer to just spruce it up and make it dry a lot faster. But I really prefer to do it while it's wet, especially on the third or fourth layer because that will make your lace definitely melt. Now because this lace is so great and awesome, I only need my sideburn hairs because y'all know I really need my sideburn hairs. And I'm just gonna use a damp cloth to clean up any extra hairspray. And I'm gonna be using my favorite styling foam, which is the Mark Anthony, just to sculpt me some bait, some flop, some uh, um, sideburn hairs and just to brush in my edges so that way they don't look so blunt and straight. I do apply some to the hairline and just brush it in. Now go ahead girl, get your black elastic band on cause you're definitely going to need that for this process and allow the front to dry. I'm just gonna take my brush and brush thoroughly and make me a nice crisp part, crispy part with my foundation, which I use, which is from Shop Miss, so Shop Miss A, whatever you wanna call it. And just press that in and then clean up any excess concealer I may have with a damp cloth. Now it's time to style this bad boy. Let me tell y'all, this wig came out really nice. I was very shocked. I think I did a really great job with the application and the bleaching of it, especially with the curls, honey, because this wig came out cut you, baby. You'll definitely have to check out the Theriatrical, Theriatrical Avenue. They have some really nice stuff that you would definitely can benefit from for your lace wig needs. For your makeup needs girl just check them out i will definitely link everything in this description box below for you guys but the hair is like a medium luster so it definitely came out really nice the curls were super easy and i do like to spray hairspray on my curls so that way they come out even more you know holding they hold better you know especially if you don't have time to put any pins in them then i would highly suggest using some hairspray and the finished look baby do it like it should be day these curls came out really nice. I told you guys, get some of that Aussie Instant Freeze. You can use it for wig application, install, and styling. And I just take like a comb and just brush through it because I noticed when you use the comb versus the brush, the curls just come out a whole lot better. So you wanna take your time and brush or comb through it. Remove that elastic band, baby. Nice deep part. You know, I, I think the curls came out really juicy and nice. I really am feeling this unit. I'll leave everything down below for you guys. This is like a grown and sexy 13 by four. Definitely something different. Um, I was not expecting it to look this nice, but it came out really, really great. So y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments and I'll leave all the info down below for Theriatrical Avenue. All right, guys, this is it. I'm done. The hair is cute. Like, the hair is nice. I don't really know what to tell you guys. 24 inches. I'm not really sure of the density. I'll definitely link it down below. But it curled really nice, really easy. Normally, when I get silky uh, textured hair, I really need to use clips to hold the curls in it. But this came out. The curls didn't fall. I like the way it curled. It got, like, some type of volume to it. It's lengthy, and it did shed a little bit. I will be honest to say that. It did shed a little bit. Um, As well as, as the, the lace, the lace smells really easy. For the most part, this wig came out nice. Theriatrical. Theriatrical. Theatrical Avenue. Check them out. They don't have a huge supply of lace front waist, but they have enough for you guys. I think it came out great for the tweezing and especially for the bleaching. I didn't keep the bleach on long. It was like 40 minutes because I did have somewhere to go. So that is the reason why I was tweezing a little bit of the speckle knots. The hair is like medium luster, which I like. I don't like it too shiny. And I think when it's like a medium luster, the curls just hold a lot better. And the hairline is decent. Really nice hairline. I like the way that it was already thinned out for you in the front. I did go ahead and thin out a little bit more. No baby hairs, girl. 
girl. Okay, what more can you ask for? I like when you don't have to put baby hairs in your unit. If you like to, that's your preference. I'll be some timey with them. One minute I do like them, one minute I don't, but I really try to do the wigs without them so that way you can see how natural the hairline is. But the, the wig came out cool, it came out good. You know, I, I do like the way it curled and I like the volume of it. So I will link everything down below. Y'all already know your girl got to go, but I will definitely see you in the comments and in another video. Check out Theatrical Avenue. I hope I'm saying it right. You know, it's a very hard word for me, but I love y'all all. Stay Diva and Divalicious. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe. Thumbs the video up and I will see y'all in the next one. Stay blessed, stay beautiful, stay out the way and mind your business. Bye.